common question is when do I replace my bowstring or when do I just perform a routine maintenance? So the answer to that question is really depending on several things. With strings, this is a wearable item, strings and cables. It's a synthetic material. It's affected by all kinds of weather conditions. It's gonna, it's gonna settle, or if the string material isn't superior, it's gonna stretch whenever it's in heat or whenever it gets hot and that wax starts to work its way out of the string, the fibers will then get tighter and tighter. And once those fibers get tighter, a lot of times the serving will then start to loosen up a little bit and start to have some slip or even some separation. Now, one thing that I want to make sure all of you know is whenever you have a cut strand, 100% that is when you need a new bowstring. If there's a strand that is coming undone, Maybe if it's one, it might get you through an emergency situation at a hunt where you don't have access to a new string or a shop, uh, but that's not something that you wanna take for a long period of time. In this situation, uh, right here where the cam was actually damaged before, there's visible, not only a cut and unraveled serving, but there's also visible cutting of that string. So in that case, 100%, let's replace the string and cable. Now, if you ever have serving separation, so a very common place for serving separation is right here where your D-loop is being pulled. And a lot of times you'll see serving separation underneath there or even in between the knocks. If you have that, 100% you need a new serving. So you'll have to get your D-loop and your knocks taken off put a new serving on and put on new knock points and a new D loop. However, if it gets to the point where you feel like that's okay, but you're starting to see some wear and tear on your string, what can I do? So this bow right here, other than the cam, is a perfect situation. This is one a buddy sent back to me and said, do I need a new string and cable? If it wasn't for that cam, I would say yes. Or if it wasn't for the cam, I'd say, no, you're going to be totally fine. Because of the cam, I'm going to say yes. However, in these areas here, which are very, very common for wearable places, one of the most common is where people grab their bow right here. A lot of people grab their bow there, or they grab their bow there, or where they're hitting their arm a lot, or moving on their arm, you're going to have some wear on the string. When it's fuzzing up like that, or it's getting dirty, or there's clumps of wax, that's totally normal. So for that, all you really need to do, and we have this bow wax that is unbelievable for the bowstring. Um, it, it literally like melts in, it's not clumpy, and it, how you put it on and how you work it into the fibers, it is perfect from the first time you put it on. Some of the older style waxes, you have to heat them up very hot to melt them in, and then they still get really, really clumpy, and especially when they get cold. Our polymetric bowstring wax is freaking super slick. It treats the string and cleans the string as well. When you take it out of the pack, you're gonna see you've got a little leather piece like this, which is awesome for working that wax into the string. But in order to maintain your string, it's super easy. All you wanna do is put a light coating anywhere that you see the exposed string. Um, sometimes you can do it here around your servings. I wouldn't go too far down the servings where they start to get into the cam, but anywhere where that serving isn't on the cam, you're gonna be good to go. So if you take this off, you're gonna see this kind of just is a nice creamy paste just like that and you can just kind of go through with your fingers at first and just put some of this knock on wax on your exposed string in the different areas again we're not putting it we're not gobbing it on but we're just putting it on just like that now take your piece of leather 
wrap it around the string and just work it in. So you can see right here where it actually had the most wear, which is where your sleeve is. You can see how clean that looks now. I mean, that string looks just like new now. Okay, so right here, I'm gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna squeeze it and work it back and forth. And you can see right here, this looks perfect. Sheen, there's not clumps, it's worked into the fiber and you can see how it melts into that piece of leather right there as it's working in. So this is really easy to do. Just go up and down your bowstring and work that in just like that. Now, one thing that I'll tell you too, that's a great little tip is if you're doing this maintenance, one of the things that you can do as well, if you have like some 3D material like this, or even if you have some dental floss, one of the things that you can do uh, when your strings start to kind of look cruddy, especially if you have lighter colored strings or flow colored strings, like for example, right here, in this area, you can see there's quite a bit of dirt. That's a very dirty, string right there. So you can take this 3D material and wrap it around it like that. Pull tight and just strip that, strip that dirt off there. So you can see right there, that is just a whole bunch of dirt and factory wax. So now taking the knock on bowstring racks and putting that on there like that. You can see if you prep that material first and strip the dirt off. Now at that point, that looks like an absolutely brand new bowstring right there. So that's all you have to do. Just keep in mind if you have cuts or visible strands that are cut or split, that's a good time to either at least seek a professional pro shop to say, is this safe to shoot? If there's ever any question, just replace it. Otherwise, using this about every month and just working that in is gonna, it's honestly gonna prolong the life of your string so much. And the price that you're gonna pay for this will literally take care of itself in a matter of one year of a normal use on a bow if you're not caring and maintaining your string. This is an incredible little maintenance item, super cheap, super easy to do, and it leaves your bow looking like new again.